this is the first time he will be a head coach in the National Hockey League. First time he's a head coach in any level of hockey, and we are underway in Detroit. But back the Red Wings come. Dylan Larkin, he's got Bertuzzi open, his shot, his shoulder save goes high in the air behind the net. So already a big save by Bobrovsky between the hash marks. Left in on the left point, Nick Letty. Back come the Panthers. They can roll three scoring lines. Pass in front. What a save by Nadelkovic. None of them are able to get a stick on Owen Tippett. A lot of bodies there, sticks in the right position. That's what they have to do against a strong team like the Florida Panthers. Pass in front. Bertuzzi's open. Deflected free and cleared by the Panthers. Well, we were just talking about how important these face-offs are. Face-off win, quick shot, and a lot of traffic. Nadelkovic. You can just see the way that the, the Florida Panthers are funneling to the front of the net. Montour standing up, about to step out of the box. Watch out, here comes Duclair and Barkov. Duclair in alone, can't control. Behind the net it goes, behind the Delkovic, and it's in! Alexander Barkov with the puck sitting on the goal line. I believe is going to get the goal, and Andrew Brunette's boys have a 2-0 lead late in the first. Right here, he reads that play with his stick, and then he jumps on it, gives it to Anthony Duclair, and how about this? He misses on it, and he still is able to put it th put it out in front for Barkov, who oh. really can bury it, but Nedeljkovic, he gets a little bit out of position right here, and then he's trying to recover. He's thinking of a wraparound, trying to go post to post. Just barely misses it. You can see the puck under his right pad. I think that should have been a whistle. Some holes in the D zone. I just can't believe for a late October game we had Ekblad and Wiggers play over 10 minutes. And the front end of a back-to-back. -back. Yeah. Score! The Red Wings are on the board! Sam Gagne deflects the Troy Stetcher shot from the right point. And Detroit makes it 2-1. On a little bit of power play that they had left. Here, it's just a quick shot coming off of the boards there and a redirect. That's the way that they're going to have to get by Bobrovsky. Yeah. It's just it get the traffic in front, take his eyes away, and also just a funny bounce there. Larkin talked about him, said he's got a quiet confidence. He knows he's going to be a difference maker. We knew what kind of skill set he had. Watch out for Hagee. Shot saved by Nedeljkovic. A key save late in the second period to keep it 2-1. to one. He likes that compete level, but what he did say is they've matured, so they can control that emotion. They're, they're not flying off the handle, and they're not un, out of control out there. Shot. A lot of shot in front. Save to Delkovic. Another save. The Delkovic keeps it 2-1, to one. and back on the wow. Red Wing. And now they're going to try to put this thing away, but Duclair, who saw a pass back to the point, is intercepted by Raymond. Here comes Larkin. Two on one. Larkin. Save Bobrovsky. Suter has it now. Back to Zadina. Quick shot in front, really to nowhere, but Fabry. Sider. Fabry, play catch. Sider. Shot. Tip. Score! We saw gets an assist on this goal. It gave them the energy, gave them the momentum back. And watch Suter taking a beating from Ekblad in front. Oh. What a beautiful tip. Is it? How high was it? It's close. We're going to look at this one. This is very close. By the way, we saw Robbie Fabry go over and get the puck, his first goal as a Red Wing, if this stands. And it looks like it's going to stand. And we're going to go to overtime. What a third period in Motown. Three on three overtime hockey can be absolutely crazy. And with the way this game has gone, I would not be surprised if this is some fun three on three here in Detroit. Gustav Forsling, the Panther defenseman, has it. Back up to Luce Durin. Again, he started the scoring. Forsling shot saved by Nabokovic off the post on the rebound. We have a Huberto Barkoff combination. This could get interesting. Yeah. Huberto. He's got Barkoff. Barkoff for the win. Score! Alexander Barkov makes it eight in a row for the Florida Panthers. Andrew Brunette, 1-0 as an NHL head coach. Barkov is so smart. Look at the way he finds that soft area there. He gets in behind the defenseman. And what about this finish? Oh, man, that is pretty.
Barkov is is really he's a setup guy. So interesting to see him down there getting that hole, finding it. Getting, I mean, beautiful, beautiful saucer pass there by Huberto. 26-year-old Finn 